Which one needs the cardio? Foam? Yeah, go hip foam. So really not off to a good start today, got up really freaking late. The first day to like get back into the shred, like changed my life. And I just fucking let myself down. I couldn't believe it, but you know, you can't dwell on that shit. So just right here, straight away in the gym. No matter what, gotta bust out the session. 40 minutes cardio, that's what I'm starting on. Uh, for the first few weeks, we'll see how we go, but you know, I don't think I'll need any more than that. It just depends, like, if I need to accelerate the shred or not. Cardio is such a good tool to just shred, uh, speed up the shred. It's the first cardio session of the shred is done. I feel good. First ab session is done. I didn't film the ab session, but if you were interested in the ab session that I do, you can click this. That's my full ab routine, and this you you just go watch the video and you'll see it. So here, packing orders now. Medium oatmeal track shorts. One more medium left. The uh, the shelves are bare. My dude Alex Fraser just asked for a shout out. He's from New Zealand, Leeston. So meal number one, oats, shake and blueberries, protein powder, and blueberries. So here we have it, 60 grams, well it's 61, but just ignore that one gram. Right, so I haven't done this in a while, but I'd say probably that much water's good. So now I'm gonna chuck it in the microwave for about a minute to start with, give it a stir and then go another minute, and then give it a stir and then maybe another minute, and then I'm gonna mix 100 grams of frozen blueberries in with that. Normally I'll mix my protein into the oats and blueberries and kind of make this nice little meal. But um, this stuff's really thick because it's a vegan protein powder, so I'm just gonna have a shake on the sides. So here we have the oats. This is just two minutes. One scoop in there. I'm so excited to just have this structure back in my life again, just like eat these exact meals every day. So here we have it, meal number one. One serve of protein powder, 60 grams of oats, and 100 grams of blueberries. So current plans for today, Eat my meals, go train legs later, and I'm actually in the process of trying to find new uh, couriers within Australia that can do competitive pricing. So yeah, that's kind of like the main plan. So this morning actually I just paid the 50% uh, the deposit on my new local order for the new gym C's drop in February. So yeah, a little bit productive already. I just realized I never ever showed you what was my final cheat meal before beginning the shreds. I'm gonna show you guys now. So last night I went to my friend Jess and Amy's and they actually hooked me a vegan roast for my final ever uh, cheat meal before the shred began. So it was actually really fucking good. I'm gonna edit it in here. Look, yo, that's it there. Look how delicious that looks. That's just like, it was fucking amazing. Amazing. So make sure you go uh, check out Jess and Amy. Their YouTube is Jack's Fitness. Uh, I'll link it in my description box below and you can go check them out. They're pumping out the vids at the moment really good quality So if you're especially if you're looking at going vegan and stuff go check them out. They're really cool Wow, well, there goes the last medium in the oatmeals Shout out to my man Karai. How do you even say that? That's a crazy name. He's from Sydney and he also got a black pair of medium Oh, we may as well actually do it. I mean we're in day one I've already done a cardio session, so I'm probably already leaner than I should be But let's do a physique check of how I'm currently looking at the start of this shred I'm not like fully like fat or anything, but Take it into the bathroom show you guys in the mirror. It's me tensing so guys, that's me there tensing as hard as I can. I'm gonna do that again in the exact same mirror in eight weeks. I also took some progress pictures, or not progress pictures, some before pictures last night so that we can compare those in eight weeks as well. Another shout out, Hamish Knowles from Little Hampton. Got some small track shorts and charcoal panel tank. And here we have him, beautiful. Shout out to my man, Caleb. He's from Bainton, Western Australia. Actually left us a nice little Little message here. Caleb, my friends, appreciate the support. I hope that you enjoy your shorts. Meal number two. We're gonna have four pizza flavored corn thins and we've got two cans, two small cans of lime cracked pepper tuna. Put the macros on screen now for you. So for most people, it's plain tuna is pretty like shitty meal, but for me, I actually kind of enjoy just having a couple of meals that I don't particularly enjoy in my diet just because they're efficient. So good for just getting your lean protein up. You, you literally can't like beat this when you're trying to hit over 220 grams of protein a day because it can be a bit hard to get protein up sometimes. And seriously, these are actually really fucking good. Go get them from... I don't know if Coles even have a pizza flavor. Go to Woolworths. Mother Nature never meant to birth another child like me. 
sitting in this grass, smoke a cigarette, but you ain't getting high like me. She's a gorgeous evening here on the Gold Coast, as always. I look this all on my own. A woman never loved me long. It's temporary, not my. This is Mermaid Beach. Uh, I don't know if you guys remember, I used to come to those bars sometimes. Normally the main bars I go to is in surfers, but sometimes I go to these ones because they used to actually live just down the road. This is actually the first street out here that I ever rode my U-Glider on. It feels weird now that I've got this like small camera vlogging. The like the annoying thing about the ADD is like it's so big. It's just a bit of a mission, eh? But so normally I'll be doing my shots for that, but it's cool. My mama told me good things coming too. But I don't got two girlfriends. Two just been uh, just doing a bit of reflection actually at the moment. Um, it's just been a bit, I don't know, just overwhelming, man. Like right now, I've just got everything invested into the business and just, this is a lot of pressure. You know, we're doing the Arnolds and it's just a fucking huge expenditure. Biggest expenditure I've ever had with the, uh, with the company and just getting a bit stressful. I know it's going to be worth it and it's all going to pay off, but probably won't see the rewards from that like for another. You know, till like three months away, and it's just hard, kind of like grinding now, getting everything done that needs to be done. You know, it's it's just frustrating when you, you, know, you don't see the rewards straight away. But I guess it's just like that. Most things in life, you know, it's always going to be worth it in the end. So just got to keep pushing and uh, keep keep doing what we're doing. Keep reinvesting back in the business. It'll all pay off in the end. I know it, but it's just really hard for me to like accept. But Okay, so it's officially day two on the shred, just woken up, and we're off to an exciting start today. Now, not only is it, you know, lovely as always waking up on a single mattress on the floor, not only has that just happened, yes, 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 yes. So these are all the new shorts and the restock of the old shorts. I've got them a bit early, they, they won't be um, dropping until the new drop. Actually, maybe I'll get the restocked shorts on the site now. I think I'll do that. If you're watching this, the oatmeal and the black shorts are restocked on the website, so go to gymsteers.com and get them if you want them. And then I'll show you the new colors in this vlog so that you can get excited for when we drop those, which I think, look at this stage, you're probably looking at about like round the 10th of February. You know what, while we're here, I may as well show you my morning routine. Pillows. And then flipping the bed up. Just like that. Welcome to the life of a entrepreneur. Honestly, man, I might talk about it in a separate video, but uh, currently, like I was saying, I think yesterday, everything's invested in gym stees. Um, and for this, we're doing the Arnold Classic in Melbourne in March, and that is the biggest fucking expense out there. So um, once that's over, <laughs> you know, I wanted to get the office space and stuff. It's so annoying, we could have got the office space already. Anyway, I gotta go do my cardio, so I'll see you guys. I'm not gonna show you guys the gym again, it's just boring. 40 minutes cardio, you know how it is. Alright, so we're back here in the office, about to reply to some emails. Gemma has just sent me a little something. In here is my dead cat for my Rode Video Mic Pro. Interesting. So, if you wanna watch the unboxing of this, uh, just go over to my unboxing channel here and you can... <laughs> I'm just fucking joking. But go subscribe to my unboxing channel. I swear I got a grey one. What the fuck? I reckon it's creepy that it's black. I swear to god, I, I ordered a grey one on the website. So here we have my rig. I'm gonna, uh, I guess I'll take the mic off and then... Dude, what the fuck is that? Is this what the fucking mic looks like? I think it goes, oh my god, it might do. It might just do. So I think that's, uh, that one there. I'll open these boxes and get some of the new shorts out. Fingers crossed they're good. You're gonna see them, guys, if they're shit. You're gonna see him. So with these shorts, because I already had the perfect shorts, like the the fit and everything of it's really happy with it. I just used the color template online to change the colors. And I think this green here is actually quite a lot different than what I imagined it to be. It's like more green than it is dark green. Um, it's kind of different still. Like I think I actually, I think it's, it might grow on me. I'm gonna put them on now. I'll try medium. Okay, these ones are kind of cool. It's like a light beige tan color. I'm definitely feeling these. These beige, oh, that's fucking sick, man. 
Feeling the beige shorts. I'm gonna actually end this vlog here. I don't want it to be too long. Um, I hope you enjoyed. Um, let me know in the comments actually if you enjoyed me. I didn't do as many like cuts and shit when I was talking. Like I was just actually just leaving it all unedited and kind of raw. Just through like my, my deeper kind of talks in this vlog. So let me know if you actually enjoyed that. Comment below because I'm still trying to find the right balance. You know, I can make an entertaining vlog which can make someone feel good but maybe not give as much value in terms of real specific emotional knowledge like transfer but on the other hand you know it's like i can make a vlog that drags out more but maybe you take more you know value from that anyway let me know in the comments what you reckon hey i just realized uh the date the date from the gym says drop february the 9th just keep that in mind it's thursday february february i can never say february god damn it i'll show you guys what i bought actually um uh, a grill only 29 dollars at kmart so uh, if you want to watch me unbox this, you can uh, just click on my unboxing channel just here and there. You guys see me unbox. I'm just fucking joking. See, so, yep, up that is there. I'm just going to make some chicken and sweet potato and broccoli meal number three, which you guys will see in like, you know, while I vlog. Um, I'll see you guys in the next vlog. Give this shit a thumbs up if you liked. It makes me feel good when you thumbs up my vid, so if you've watched till the end, thumbs this shit up. Okay, I'm actually going to now. Bye.